Would you rather be attacked by 12 duck-sized horses or one horse-sized duck? Um, I would say one horse-sized duck. Well, what I'd do if it was a horse-sized duck is I think I'd tame it. Oh. and then I would use it as a pet that I could ride around instead of a car. Obviously with the, the increased cost of petrol at the moment, it is getting quite expensive to, to run a vehicle um, if you've got a horse-sized duck. Would, would it need reins? Um, I think I'd tame it and you know I'd, I'd train it that well. It probably wouldn't. I could just communicate through certain duck noises. Um, or would it be horse-like noise? Ooh. Duck stroke horse noise. Could, could um, you try that for me? Um, uh, no, I'd have to practice really. Okay. I couldn't. Okay. You know, T- when I've done it with my horse-sized duck, I'll let you know. And, uh, and a final question, uh, in the week of the same-sex marriage bill, um, Brad Allen says, are you single and looking for a handsome Australian based uh, Australian fella based in Manchester? <laughs> uh, unfortunately, I'm not single. I um, have a partner. What have you just Keen, are you interested, Jeff? Um, yes, I am. Um, <laughs> No, I have a girlfriend, uh, okay. Isabel, lovely girl, um, so we might have to fight her first. Excellent stuff. Well, we look forward to your contributions on Sunday, Dan Carl. Thanks for your time. Thank you very much.